from Outdoor Travel Channel, it's Cooking with Rob. Before we get started, please take the time to subscribe, then click on the bell icon to get notified of our future videos. Hey, welcome to Cooking with Rob. Today we're going to make something very special for Easter. Uh, it's just a little treat and uh, it, it's not going to take very long to make, but I just discovered, of course, the magic bullet. I'll put the description down below. If you haven't got one of these yet, you got to get one. They're really easy to use and really easy to clean up. And today, we're just going to make a simple little milkshake with fresh strawberries, a little bit of ice cream, a little bit of milk. That's it. A very good milkshake but that isn't too sweet. So let's get going. Alrighty, we're set to go. So, all you're going to need is strawberries, which are uh, flourishing in the stores right now. They're uh, everywhere you go to strawberries. So grab some. And by the way, you can actually go to the store, buy a whole bunch of strawberries, and cut them up, cut the tops off, make sure you wash them, and freeze them whole. And you can just grab a few every time you want to make something. Uh, in this case, we're making milkshakes. But yeah, now we have our strawberries ready. I'm going to pick out pretty ripe ones. And I'm just making a milkshake for me. So I'm, uh, if I was making a full uh, amount of <laughs> milkshake for here for me and Sherry, I'd probably grab five, but I'm going to grab, oh, let's say uh, three really big ones. And so I'm going to wash them up real quick and then we'll cut them. Okay, we washed up our uh, strawberries and I'm just going to use three. We're going to cut the tops off real quick. And they've been all cleaned up already. And uh, I'll take a little bit more off on that one. Put all these scraps to the side. And uh, make sure I don't have any blemishes, aren't too bad. So those look pretty good. That's all we're going to do. Grab the top for your uh, magic bullet. Uh, you don't really have to cut them up, but this will make it a lot easier for me to blend faster. So I'm just going to put them in the magic bolt real quick. And that's it. Next, we're going to grab some ice cream. And I like Tillamook, and I also like the old-fashioned vanilla. So uh, I'm going to grab this and fill it. Oh. About three quarters of the way. I gotta try to remember I'm just making this for myself and not with Sherry, so I tend to probably make too much. So, probably a little bit more. I kind of like my milkshakes a little bit thick. Now the rule of thumb I use with the milk is uh <laughs> to go three quarters of the way up from the ice cream and kind of level this out a little bit so I can see I got some 2% milk here here I'm going to fill this up to about well that's about perfect I thought it was going to need more but I'm good put this to the side and we're ready to blend so uh What's nice about this milkshake is it's not too sweet. Uh, is it healthy for you? <laughs> well, it's got ice cream in it. But uh, your magic bullets, piece of cake to put on. Moving to the side. Okay, we're ready to put our magic bullet on. And uh, basically, all you do is push down. Just make sure I get a good mix. I like the shape. And that should do the trick. So I always grab myself a, since I'm always messy, I grab myself a cup. Open her up. This is where you can drip a little bit. God, does that look good? Yum! So there you go, guys. <laughs> A strawberry milkshake made with fresh strawberries. Let me taste it real quick here. 
I love it. Nice strawberry taste, not too sweet. Don't add any syrup, don't add anything. Just keep it simple. And so, uh, <laughs> magic bullet, I'm telling you, it's a great, great tool. And uh, they whip up a little thing for the munchies, something uh, you just need a treat. Grab a couple strawberries, a little ice cream, a little milk, and you're set to go. So thanks for watching. <laughs> See you next time, guys. Bye. Yum. <sighs> yeah. Thank you for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over. Then go down to the description and think about becoming a member of our Patreon. This will allow you to get special content just for you and help us build future content. Thank you.